is Sophie Dawson from sophiedawson.com. Look at him, look. He's quite cool, isn't he? Two quid in the, what's it called, little shop round here. I thought he was quite cool. Neat. But this is another little click look video where I click the look at various art books. And today we're going to be looking at Sketch Every Day, which is a little art book by one of my favourite artists, Simone Grunewald, by 3D Total Publishing. Now, I, I found out about this artist, Simone Grunewald, from a character design quarterly magazine. And I actually did an article and a podcast about her, but I love her artwork. So I've been following her on Twitter and everything, or Instagram. I've been wanting to get this book for ages, so I finally got it. Little Dennis is with us today. I picked Little Dennis because I think that those two colours are beautiful together. And Little Dennis, he's my favourite, he is, Little Dennis. But this book is really cool. It's, it's like a little, it is like a little sketchbook. And it's got this beautiful little thing. Oh, look at that. <laughs> That's cool, guys. It's got this little slipcase thing on it. Look, at, look how beautiful her artwork is. So, hopefully, she's going to help us get better at sketching. But this book is quality. Because you've got, like, it's got, like, a grippy texture on the front. It's only on the front, but it's beautiful. And also, apparently, this one's signed by the artist. That's what, it, that's what they said. But I can't see any signatures anywhere. Liars! Ah, maybe it was only like the first, first, what was it? It did say the first so many had assigned, look at that look. That's quite cool. That's a nice way, I love that. Oh, she's got a little texture as well. Cool, nice. I love that. Oh, this paper is really thick. Nice. This is what I love about 3D Total Publishing. It's, it's quality. It's the quality and the details that I like. Sketch every day. Over 200 pages of art and sketching techniques. This is going to be amazing. So this one came out, I think it came out, uh, 2019. It came out last year. It came out right at the end of last year, I think. It's got loads of stuff in here. This is going to be amazing, I think. Let's look at this. The, the paper's got like a, a pretend crease creases in it, which is cool. Again, like a sketchbook. Look at her artwork. It's so beautiful. So I think the best way to get better at drawing is to study from the people you love the most. So if you look, because I love her artwork so much, I feel like it's the best person to study from. Look at, look at the, the, the way they've designed the book. It's beautiful. The books are like a work of art. So we start out with a little, oh, this is cool, look. It's a little story. She's actually drawn it. <laughs> That's cool. It's got a little, little computer. Finding art friends. What's this one here, I wonder? That's cool, that is. On a little drawing board. What a fun way to do it. That's good as well. Look, we get a little timeline of our actual artwork. I love that. Little characters. I like little characters. Yeah, her art is just, it's, it's beautiful. Baby. Hey, she has a little baby look. Just 
big headed bold <laughs> big headed big headed little baby she's got a little tablet little for this wake or something beautiful absolutely beautiful artist's advice this will be fun my experience as an artist mean i've tried and tested so much along the way and one of those things is of course sketching nearly <laughs> i like that she's put little brackets nearly every day if you had a baby you can't probably can't sketch every day the habit of sketching yeah look little tips it's gonna be fun i got that every single bag i've got got a little tiny sketchbook in it with a little drawing peep ah cool it's got one of those as well i like it when you get those little things a nice sexy olive green your little inspirational quotes as well cool i like this yeah, I remember she did She did the article, I think, about how to capture an essence in your character. And she had these little little sketches of in coloured pencils. Yeah, like this. The thing about that is just, it really makes me feel nice. Cool. Look. How amazing these little... I hope I can do that one day. Something like that. Would just... Little flower pot people. Becoming an artist. So much has changed over the years from my own approach and technique to getting my work noticed and making a living from my art. That's a cool one. This paper is beautiful. It's, quite, it's kind of like... um. It's that sort of rough paper. Yeah, hey look, I'm often happy with a super rough sketch. <laughs> rough. You like rough. My workspace is too cramped. These characters are amazing. She really does get so much character in her characters. Finding your style. I don't think you find your style, I think it finds you. Inspired character design. This is so cool. It's going through everything, look. You can get so many tips in, out of this book, I think. You can get so many tips, but you've also got loads of sketches to copy. It's going to be quite cool. Uh, yeah, that maybe that's why I like earthy tones. Yeah, her tones are very nice. Her colour choices. That's cool. Look. Oh, look at this one here. Look. That's quite a cool little effect. You can actually work through the process of. Bringing things to life. Oh, look. I prefer that style. It's absolutely beautiful, the lighting on it. The tools. <laughs> the tools trap. Keep it simple, I say. Art fundamentals. Little art fundamentals, light and shade. This is good, this. Really nicely put together. Look how beautiful that is. Highlighted edges. Oh, I like that. Yeah. That's what was in that one there. I'm going to learn loads in here, I think. Lighting effect. Different lighting. It's quite interesting. Hey, look. It's quite cool. Visual stability. Visual stability. Push 
perspective and depth. Oh, uh, see, I find stuff like that really hard. Drawing things in weird. Yeah, draw it. she's done what um what his face could done. David Hone said, "Turn everything into boxes. Get the box in perspective, and then get the shapes." I wonder if she did the box first and then put the character, or she put the box around the character. Cool, these are. Even her little rough sketches are amazing. Accurate reflections. That'd be interesting. Overlapping objects creates the illusion of depth. That's what I learnt. When you overlap objects, do it deliberately. That's quite good. Awareness. God, there's so many cool little quotes in here as well. Background interest. That was in one of the other, in the article, I think, was it the fairy one? Yeah, the one I just did on the podcast. Made me realise the background is, is tells a story. Like the, like the character. Composition, look, I like that. Drawing herself working. Quite cool. Composition spacing. I like that. It's got all different colours in it. Look. It's cool. See, I'd leave it like that. <laughs> I think it's great. Yeah, amazing, isn't it? That, that is amazing. Somehow she didn't lose any of the liveness. Here we go, colours. Don't like that one. That might be my favourite. That's cool. Balance. Choosing a palette. Grayscale. Oh, loads of tips in here. Popping colours. Pop. Colouring lines. Look how cool these are, look. So, so simple, but so much energy in them. Lo love this. Oh, these are cool, look. Amazing, look at her, look. Look at her. Really cool. Telling stories. <laughs> that's funny. I bet that's her with a little baby. Little melons. <laughs> They're melons. Oh, that's nice. God, I'd love to see her actual sketchbooks. She should release a book full of full of her sketches. Just a book full of sketches. That'd be cool. A book full of her sketches. Character designs. Making faces. Oh, cool. Eyes. I need to read this. I'm scared of eyes. Oh, I like it. Yeah, I'm going to have to read this. Noses. Little noses. Lips. We like lips. Talking heads. That's a nice one. Shape language. God, there's so much good stuff in here. A different view. Strange angles. Four candles. Hey, <laughs> four candles. 
female form. That's weird, look, little shapes. Torso. Males. That's quite interesting to compare. Baby steps. Look, little babies. Helping hands. Again, look. Putting into feet, feet first. Oh, I like that. What a nice little shape. Hmm, that's funny. Nice shoes. Striking a pose. Oh, a lovely pose. That's a nice pose as well. Love that pose. Caught in action. That's what she does the best, I think. Captures like motion. Motion and energy. I like about her drawings. Body language. Cool. Connecting characters would be fun as well. Nice. Yeah, silhouettes. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful, like, silhouette that is. Good hair day, girls. Hey. <laughs> to be quite fun. Playing with the shapes that cool. Looking at light sources. Well groomed guys. Yeah, no, look, we never. He looks a little bit like um. There's books as kids. As a kid, there was this book with skeletons in it. I can't remember what it was called. Two little skeletons. Like friends. <laughs> Funny please. Getting dressed. Little fabric folds. Cool pose. I like that one, that. <laughs> yeah, props. That's funny. Aging artfully. They look quite fun. Like fun little... Fun little people. Tips. Dippy tips. We like tips. Are you for real? Realistic figures. Cool. Yeah, loads of little tips of a, a dog. Doggies. Basic shapes. Oh, what a cool pose that is. Stretching. Yeah, look. Cool. Yay, little cats. We like cats. Little Dennis likes his cats, doesn't he? He likes eating them. <laughs> little Dennis. Little Dennis. Love cats. Look at that. How cool is that? Hey, oh, funny one. Little wet, little wet. Oh, nice. Little bit naughty though. It's a, looks like it is it about to attack you or something. Trees. We love trees. Mushrooms. Look like a little person, that. Fairy tales. Family life. Little baby. Look, she's still drawing. Despite having a little baby. Little baby. Life is a mum. An artist. Yeah. 
interesting how her life changed. Yeah, I like that one. That was in the um, blur. Lovely. Making the weekend work. Huh. Wonder if she's got li any little pets. I like those little pet pigeons. Wonder how old her baby is. Oh, lovely. That's nice, that. I love that as well. A day in my life. <laughs> Look, she's eating as she's walking. Uh, make sure you're resting. It's important to rest. We like, we like resting. Oh, I don't want it to finish. It's the finish, look. Thank you. Still got that little texture on the paper. I love that. I think I have to say this is one of the most beautifully put together books I've ever seen. And it's it's got such beautiful artwork. And I can tell I'm going to learn loads out of here. I absolutely love that. that. Beautiful. One of my favourites, that. And it's got, I love it when they do that text on the texture on the front. Look how Dennis looks with that, look. That brown and green is a really nice combination. I hope you enjoyed that. It was a little look at the sketch every day. A book by Simone Grinwald. By 3D Toto Publishing, and we can see you later for another one. Lovely little book that was.